Alrighty, welcome back. This is your redneck relic, Paku from Landfraggers.com. Today we're doing episode three, and what we're gonna do is go fishing. Teach you guys how to fish. Now what I always do is make sure that I have a bunch of spears for fishing because this ain't fishing with a pool a pole excuse me this is fishing with a spear and it's a lot of fun I think you'll have a good time so without further ado well I think we're gonna have to wait it's a little bit cold let's go in here and get next to the fire and I'll introduce you to some of the stuff that I've done uh oh, looks like I might be out of wood. Got plenty of food here. Alright. Fire. Okay. We have some sleeping bags down. Those things are one time use. So if you die, it'll give you a spawn point one time. This one right here is a bed. That's permanent. So you can always spawn back here, but there is a timer on them. So if you die, and then you die again real fast, then it will make you wait, or else put you out in the middle of nowhere. We also made us uh, a mortar and pestle, and this is going to be used for uh, making narcotics and gunpowder and stuff like that. It's pretty neat. Um, and I did this all without taping you got uh, videotaping it because I forgot to hit the doggone button but that's all right we'll continue to roll let me show you I got 18 dodo eggs and one dilo egg isn't that wonderful These are small storage boxes, and I'm going to have to redo them. We'll do that after we make this place into a wooden place instead of thatch. I got meat here going spoiled, but I'm doing that for a reason. We need them to make narcotics. We also uh, went out and caught us a bunch of more dodos after all them dodos got killed. And then I decided I wanted to get some dilos. Because the dilos will help protect this area. They're pretty good guard dogs. Guys are leveled up. All they have to do is bring their health up so that they can survive an attack. I don't think he's ready yet. No, nope, he's still got a little bit left. What about you, other two? Oh, you look like you're ready. Now these guys, I'll go ahead and bring their health up. And then I'll bring their melee. Just to make them more effective guard dogs. I'm not silly enough to think that they're going to survive for very long. Because they'll throw themselves right into the fray. We'll try to get their health up above about 500 or so. 
Okay, it's too dark to, to fish, so what else you guys think we should be doing? What do I got as far as craftables? Nothing I really need to mess with. Well, I'm gonna put us on hold right now until the sun comes up. I'll be right back, guys. And we're back. How you guys doing? Looks like the sun's starting to come up and we're ready to go fishing. Again, make sure you have your spears, because that's what we're going to need. And let's head on to my favorite fishing hole. Oh, we're going to have to go take care of that one real fast. See what it's got in it. fishing hole. It's a small stream. Not very deep so there won't be any sharks or anything like that in it. There might be piranha so you always just take a step in and look. Now make sure you got plenty of spears. I got six on me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to step in the water over my head and just look around. If there's piranhas in there they're going to come after me pretty quick. I don't see none, but I do see these here thingies. Big old coal sucker fish. And we've got our first one. <laughs> Take them out, throw them on the sand, and we're gonna prep them. Good source of meat. They don't give you nothing else, but they give you plenty of meat. On a normal server, you'll usually get, you know, up to ten, but usually around five. I've got these stacked, so I don't have to waste a lot of time with grinding again. Let's see. There's another one. There's a bunch of them over here. Let's get that green one. I want you to see how big this son of a gun is. Oh shoot, I still got pieces of him. That's a right big fish, don't you think? Wait for my stamina to come up a little bit. Oh, 
with a fish, you can use either one of the tools. They don't supply anything but meat. Goodness. truth that's about all the meat we're gonna need for a little while now we're gonna go put this into the meat box so that we can make spoiled meat and maybe we'll put some on the fire too grab some wood Cloth, clothing, armor, crap that I'm wearing. Sure is getting wore out. Hopefully, pretty soon I'll be able to make some good hide armor. guys where's my eggs I don't understand why you ain't got no eggs out here I need them dino eggs guys see now these girls know what they're doing It's gonna put us over 20. Ooh wee, I can't wait till I can get me a garden going. Make some good kibble. Now this spoiled meat will spoil also. What do I do with the rest of it? I thought I had like a hundred of them. There they are. Oh, 
Oh, we can make some. All right. I forgot I did level. Let's get this stuff. That stuff. Now, again, the best thing about crafting things is the experience. You get experience for it. get a level up hopefully probably won't here spark powder that stuff you use instead of wood for fires drugs is we can make 34 of them now those narcotics what we'll do with those is we'll make trank arrows once we get a bow. Them tranquilizer arrows, you shoot them in the head with a few of them and they'll knock them out and then you can go ahead and tame them. Let's go and throw some of this meat on a fire here. So we got tranks going or narcotics going. That's gonna give us experience. And we can go collect some rocks and some flint and make spark powder if we want to. But I think we're just gonna call it a day right there for this episode. A little easier for me to uh It's a little easier for me to edit when they're small. Alright guys, that was fun. I took you out and taught you how to fish. Taught you how to make narcotics. We are getting on, man. Won't be too much longer we'll be taking on that big old trike out there. Heck, we might do it next episode. Well, that'd be about it. You guys like what you've seen? Go ahead and pound that like button. Or go ahead and subscribe to me. I am going to be doing quite a few of these things. I appreciate you coming out and joining me. And we'll see you next time. Y'all come on back now, you hear? This here is your... Redneck Relic signing off. <laughs>